Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, Quarty Baby So Machine. So for today, we're going to be reacting to CJ Soku faces backlash after this. Not again, okay? But before we get started, you already know the video. Don't forget to subscribe, turn the notification bell on so you can get notified every single time I upload a new video, okay? Follow me on my social media platforms, Instagram, Twitter, Snapchat, and TikTok. The links will be in the description box down below for your convenience. And without further ado, let's get started, right? Hmm, let's sip this tea. Okay, guys, so more drama with CJ So Cool. Now, this one has nothing to do with his relationship with royalty or Tata. Now, he's facing backlash for mocking victims of police brutality. They got the squad coming, man. It's because D-Lo with me, bruh. Yeah. I'll never get pulled over, man. Oh, oh always God. with you. Please don't shoot me, bro. Please. Shoot me. You know what I hate? Let's just keep watching, cause. Uh, I got kids. Uh, 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 God, he called me back up. Why do you always call me back up, bro? I have my license, registration, insurance in my hand out the window before he even got out the car. Why do you need back up? I clearly, clearly am not doing nothing illegal, bro. Pray for me, y'all. I don't even ever go nowhere. I just came from looking at a property, man. And now I got pulled over. I'm supposed to be at the Golden Knights game. Look, my boy got the gear on. The Golden Knights saved me, bro. I'm trying to rush so I can change and put on my clothes and come to the game, bro. Golden Knights, take, take the police from me, bro, please. So the Shade Room teens did post this, and of course, CJ had to respond, and he says, shaking my head, instead of investing in hating on one another, how about you invest in fixing the problem? How did me moving myself crying over my family leaving turn into me mocking the dead? The two had nothing to do with each other, but I'll allow myself to be a vessel for you all to hate. Like I stated on my live, all officers aren't bad, just like all officers aren't good. But the truth remains, if you comply with authorities and keep your hands and mouth closed with all credentials, then that leaves them no room to harass you. But believe what you want, your opinions are just that, opinions. Rest in peace to all the victims of police brutality. Now at this point, I believe CJ just needs to go back into hiding. And exactly. He just needs to go back into hiding for real. Like, what? not even say anything because he is saying all of the wrong things about everything the whole situation with this the situation with tata the situation with royalty cj at this point you just cannot get it right you're always in the news for something that you're stating you didn't mean by it and you said the wrong words and you didn't mean it that way this, will be the, this must be the generation of don't say anything because it could be taken with out of context hey well maybe you just not need to say anything at all right. now i am going to post the live that he did after let me know what you guys think about this down in the comment section below you guys feel like recently that's all he has been you know in drama 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 t pages t pages t pages he might be enjoying this honestly he was being insensitive or at this point do you guys not care about anything that cj has to say let me know down in the comment section below oh let me show y'all bro it's very good to the game not only let me just wait man let me wait man you know what i'm saying i always wait so i'm wait. i'm just so happy right now man i got so much to say so much to say man ooh, ooh. I gotta get it off my chest. That's the golden night traffic. Stop playing with me. Listen, man. I got a lot to say, but I'm not gonna take a long time to say it. I'm gonna say it right now. Clearly, I'm not arrested. I didn't get in trouble. Video coming out tomorrow, and it's not gonna be about the police, but that is in the beginning of the video, yes. Um, I got pulled over for doing 140 in the 65 in my Lambo. Obviously, I'm not in a Lambo right now. I got my boy D-Lo driving. He's yeah, way I'm, more concerned. I'm driving that. He's driving the Benzo. Yes, sir. Look, man. I got pulled over, like I said, for doing illegal activity. Driving too fast while being black. But guess what didn't happen? I did comply, and I didn't get killed, shot, arrested, or illegally searched. I was arguing with somebody in my um, DMs just a few seconds ago. They said I made a mockery of George Floyd and all the people that lost their life due to the, the crooked cops, basically. Look. 
happens all day. People get pulled over all day, every day, every city, every state. It doesn't matter, right? But the one thing that a lot of black people forget to do is to remain calm and have your credentials. If you got a valid license, insurance, and registration, you will not have to worry about nothing. Oh, I forgot the most important part. Let me start over. If you have a valid license, valid insurance. I'm annoyed. Like, I'm really annoyed. Valid registration and a great attitude, you don't have to worry about nothing. Ask D-Lo. D-Lo was nervous when he, he was in the passenger seat, nervous and scared. I saw him. He was he was acting weird, different. To me, I'm in the driver's seat. I'm a lot more in control of the situation because I handled it appropriately. I didn't say, why you pull me over for, man? Dang, what's up with you? I didn't do none of that. But people that got, you know, killed by police brutality weren't always doing that. They weren't always being loud. They weren't always like yelling or being agitated or anything like that some of them were actually doing what they were supposed to but they were still brutalized and some shots i didn't say man i got my license with the head i didn't do none of that so when you comply with the police it's a lot harder for them to act rude when you're rude i like how you say it's a lot harder for them to act rude but it is possible for them to act rude so let's acknowledge that Okay, because he's making it seem like everyone that went through it is because something was off. Like either they were being rude or they didn't have their credentials or whatever the case may be. Or they had a, like a rude attitude. This is just ignorant. Like, like, mm -mm. They go off your vibe. So give the police exactly what you want back from them. It's kind of like treating people how you want to be treated. You treat them with respect, they're going to treat you with respect. It's simple. But. Ignorance at its max like what i'm just saying this all cops ain't bad all cops i agree bad. i have friends that are cops not all cops are bad like i have like two people that are cops that i know personally so not all of them are bad but like i said there's some bad ones out there that will get you know get get to you and hurt you for nothing like couple like we've seen in the past so him saying this is annoying and good the cop i ran into today was definitely a good person i appreciate that but now i'm on the way to the game everybody see i'm safe not in jail because i'm not a criminal i don't got no warrants after my arrest so i'm good that being said a lot of you cloud chasers that wish i was in jail sorry for you you might end up in jail but i'm not you all right so keep cloud chasing Maybe it'll work for you one day. But I'm gonna go have some fun in the game. Y'all make sure y'all stay tuned for that YouTube vlog, man. We going up, not down, man. Get out. Oh, Lord. <laughs> oh, my gosh. I'm over this. I'm over this, man. That's the end of today's reaction video. That's you guys' man's, man. I hope you guys enjoyed it. What you guys think, tell me. Do you guys, do you guys feel like he was being funny? Or, um... Do you guys feel like you know it's not that it's not that big of a deal, it's whatever or or what? Let me know, guys. Let me know, cause recently he has just been in so many drama, and I'm just like I want to react to it, but then I'm like it's just too many people talking about him, and I'm like is it worth me doing the same? Most of the time I said no, so I don't. But this time I was like let me just go ahead and just you know mention him here on my channel. I think it's the first time I talk about him on my channel. Maybe the second time, but I don't remember talking about him ever before. But um, yeah, you guys let me know what you guys think. Once you subscribe, if you are new, don't forget to turn the notification bell on so you can get notified every single time I upload a new video. Do not forget to follow me on my social media platforms: Instagram, Twitter, Snapchat, and TikTok. The links will be in the description box down below for your convenience. And yeah, I will catch you guys on my next one. Bye, guys.